Hello and welcome to my experiences and reviews. In this channel I share my first-hand experience of product unboxing, reviews, installation and assembly, knowledge and information sharing for your benefits and the benefits of society. So, tag along by subscribing to this channel. And, if you find some contents useful or if there are some areas of improvement, please feel free to comment on the respective video section. We appreciate your feedback. Hi everyone, welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to show you my first hand experience of unboxing wireless charging car mount. So uh, there are a couple of synergies, the reason why I purchased this product and I would like to share my experience with you guys and uh, uh, the unboxing of this uh, product. As we can see here, I'd like to show you the price first, obviously, whenever we are going to purchase any product, it's around 159 dirhams in UAE and uh, I have purchased this product from uh, Sharaf DG a popular electronic supplier in the Middle East so before going into details let me show you a different side of the box as we can see here uh, it's mentioned here Liberator is, is it's the product model and 15 watt I mentioned here and um, you know it's it's basically, it's basically one of the very important requirement especially when you are a traveler and you like to uh, explore new places always uh, using your gps location maps so the thing is um, you know always you need to bother you may need to plug your mobile always in with the charging port in your car and uh, this will not only give you a vision a sort of um, holder in your car and at the same time it will provide you car charging so again uh, uh, this is just new to me uh, it's for the first time i'm using i will be using this product so i thought to share my experience with you guys as we can see here there are different types of equipment or arrangements we can see here uh, obviously it should be a 360 degree mount i mean if you are driving a car and you would like to uh, record a video of the road ahead or sort of you know there are some certain te terminologies we use as time-lapse videos obviously you would need a this car mount so not only it will give you the place to uh, uh, install or mount your mobile but also it at the same time you don't have to worry about the charging of your mobile phone obviously when you are driving for a long distances uh, for instance uh, for two three hours of drive and um, you are not plugging in your mobile phone so the end is you will you might end up with the um, low battery and you know uh, your complete uh, visit will might become a nightmare so uh, avoiding those things um, uh, i thought it's a good idea to buy, buy this product obviously i did not uh, think about any brand here but uh, my only focus was the equipment itself so let me just try to unbox this one obviously we need a cutter Well, here we are with the unboxed. Uh, first, we have to see this module itself. Okay, this should be adjustable. Let's see what else we have got here. Uh, it's a mount for AC vent. If you are not going to use uh, the other mount, so basically it's AC mount with the lock. All right. So this is the main uh, mounting arrangement or assembly. As we can see here, we have uh, uh, air sucking module. And uh, which is quite nice, you can uh, place this on the windscreen or on the dashboard. Obviously, the surface should be clean enough. Uh, it's a sort of air mounting arrangement or air sucking arrangement. 
so let me see as we can see this is the first adjustment and uh, by ball I understand that it will be a 360 type of rotation its angle adjustment all right here we have got a cable luckily it has got a c type charging uh, for instance i have a um, note 8 mobile phone so uh, obviously i can use it directly also but <clears throat> if i purchase this one so what i heard about c uh, type cable it's it's quite efficient than a normal uh, <clears throat> you know standard usb porting uh, usb port cable So here we go. Uh, manual here, a little manual, obviously in English. And here in Chinese, <laughs> if you would like to read, if you can understand, okay, you can go through this side also. Let's go get to this side. All right. So this has got a one year warranty in the price of 159 dirhams in UAE. So I was trying to extract this thing but uh, still uh, so what, the, what they are saying here uh, let me read this step one when the power is on the arms will open automatically all right so basically you need to switch on the power put on the mobile phone the arms will automatically clamp it's a very nice feature here a step to what they're saying press the button on the bottom side the arms will open automatically and you can take out the phone so basically in order to use these buttons here on the bottom we need to plug in the power and here we can see a port here and let me show you how it works hi guys so i just connected the power uh, cable here it's again a C type cable as I've shown you earlier on. Uh, obviously it's, uh, you know, without, uh, I would say, charger. Uh, only the cable was there, but of course, uh, most of us are, are now having uh, standard uh, charging uh, adapters. So I just plugged in into charger and this is a C type cable I will just insert here. So as we can read here, uh, it's clearly mentioned that step one is uh, when the power is on the arms will open automatically so as we can see the power is on it's it's showing here uh, there is a small little light here which means that it's under charging stage all right so uh, as I can uh, it's I was thinking initially that it, it should be a offline uh, sort of module but um, as we have gone through the instructions here and this was the reason again to share experiences to avoid uh, mistakes by other people so basically uh, uh, there are quite nice nice features available here we just need to push the button to uh, you know expand the clamps so there are two ways either by the button or by uh, the mobile phone itself so since uh, I'm using this note 8 itself for the recording of this video I'll, uh, I'm so, uh, my apologies that I will not be able to show you Note 8 here, but okay, I've got another mobile phone which has got um, wireless charging option, it's Samsung S6. So let me place it here. So as we can see, when I place this mobile phone here, it automatically gets extracted, uh, uh, sorry, um, uh, extracted or as per the size of this mobile phone and now as we can see here it's charging fine so let me show you again when, when, when we have to remove this one obviously we need to push the button see I will remove this one let me show it again I just place it here and it automatically locks the mobile phone so very nice feature and uh, I hope uh, it should work continuously I mean uh, for the long period of time obviously this is the first time I have purchased this product and uh, yeah now let's move on to the mounting arrangements so we have seen here the charging arrangements and uh, how we need to place the mobile phone inside 
and uh, you know it's sort of an automatic functions there is a button here you can remove easily and when we place it here it automatically clamp the mobile all right so coming back to the mounting arrangement uh, as we have got here a knob uh, so first the main assembly which is uh, for the windscreen for table arrangement or for the car dashboard obviously so we just need to i i believe we need to ex loosen this one first so as we have loosened this mobile uh, this screw we have again so this is a very nice arrangement you can see almost 360 degrees rotation plus the angle adjustment or height adjustment from this lever so once i get into my car uh, i'll try to record another video while placing this device on uh, on my dashboard or i would say on the windscreen as well so yeah, and this is you know quite a standard phenomena here uh, sort of air lock arrangement so once we place this on any of the surface we need to just sorry now it's now it's uh, unlocked when I place this one in this play, uh, in this uh, position to any of the harder surface, I need to uh, press this red knob here, so it's gonna extract the air, trying to keep it um, stick to the uh, surface where we are trying to. And uh, okay, all right, let me remove this device. Let's try the other function. So once you loosen this one, it's sort of uh, plug and play arrangement and this is uh, here we have got the second option which is for AC vents obviously same principle will apply here we just need to plug like here once you hear a click sound then it means that you are good to go tightening this screw again we have got a uh, sort of locking arrangement Usually it's not available on normal devices, on normal tools, as we can see here. With that there top, you can uh, still uh, have the liberty to squeeze this clamp as per the size of the AC vents you have got in your car. It's have got nice support so that, you know, uh, once you have plugged this into your AC vent, uh, it should not uh, bend like this or in another direction. So again, it's, it, has, it has got a quite nice arrangement here. So that's it for this video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I would like to record another video by placing this device on my car dashboard. Uh, but the, that's it for now and I hope you like this video. Uh, and this is a nice device obviously when, if you are a YouTuber, if you are traveling a lot, you would like to... Um, you know you you are you, you are losing you are using this uh, maps a lot then it's uh, one of the best device you should have. Uh, charging as well as um, viewing of your mobile phone while driving safety features and it has got everything which you need which, which should you should have in your car again this is a box thank you uh, if you like this video please do let us know by hitting like button and uh, if you like uh, if you like to just support us um, preparing this content please subscribe to our channel as in this way we will get a sort of a token of appreciation from your side and we will be able to record further videos along the time thank you so much for being here bye bye